was my light AF, fixing to do the turkey. Oh, I'm Starting sorry. down a rock bridge. Gonna head up to the road, hit Osborne Trail, the Lost Branch, the Sheltoe, and then uh, on around the head of the turkey. That's rough trail. Down to Pincham Tight, Coomer Ridge, Silver Mine. Back up to Rough Trail. By the Coomer Ridge. And then uh, by the Coomer Ridge Trail, and then back up to uh, here. So, Rock Bridge. Rock Bridge Arch. What's up, man? We're on the Turkey Trail. I got these jokers with me for now. I don't know for how long. If they can hang, we may do the whole turkey together. Who knows? That's 50 miles. But uh, check this out Rock Bridge Trail coming in. Look at that waterfall. How beautiful is that? That's what I'm thankful for more than anything. I love my wife. I love my kids. I love my grandson. But that, man, I love it. He's going to be a part of this. I can't wait till you get older, Kane, and you can go with Papa. We're going to see these trails. I'm going to show you all of them. Look at that. that. Man, so beautiful. Whew. Oh, you want to watch that? That cave right in. Look at that. Get it all in frame. Don't go down there. That feels like that ledge is going to give out. Look how beautiful. You know, you could slide right down that, but that drop right there, that would hurt your bum a little. You know what I'm saying? How beautiful. What do you think, Brad? Be Brad. Awesome place. On the turkey trail. Oh man, this Rock Bridge Trail, it's beautiful, man. I really love that entrance. That's the start. When we hit the, well, that's, that's the arch right there. When we hit that arch, that's when the trail really begins. That was just the approach. This is probably one of the most beautiful arches in the park. It's in my top 10 for sure. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. If that's not the most beautiful thing. That's what it's about right there. Oh man, what about this trail? So beautiful. Oh yeah. Gotta love this place. It's like you're in a whole different world. There's a campsite out there, but it's not there now. That tree must have fallen on the entrance. Whoop. All right, boy, this place is rugged. I love it. Oh no, here's the trail right here. That goes up to an amazing campsite. And up there, you can get up on the ridge. It's just fantastic. Steep section right here. Swift Camp Creek. 
We're about, we're probably five miles in out of the eight. So we're working our way up out. But this ain't as bad a section as that last. Day. About three more miles. This ain't as bad a section as the beginning of it. We're gonna go back through there to get to the car though. Is that cool? I got a wedge you don't look. Okay. Oh. What up? What do you think? <laughs> Holy! What do you think, Shanana Hand? Hi. You That's didn't catch snail. me picking That's my wedgie and right falling, there. did you? Yep. Uh -huh. Yep. Hey, will you look in this and tell me what that looks like? Is that a good distance? Oh yeah. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a obstacle. Man, crawling under looks like a pain to me. You gotta get totally, you gotta get totally flat, down, all the way down. Oh my God! Oh, you're recording this. Yeah. All right, we made it up off of Swift Camp Creek Trail. It's like eight, eight and a half. That's a rough trail. They should have renamed Rough Trail, switched names with Swift Camp and Rough Trail. What do you think, Brad? Do what do you think about that? That was brutal. Trail. That was brutal, wasn't it? Brutal. Shane Ham. What up, Teacup? Teacup. <laughs> what do you think? You just went through the hardest trail in Red River. This was supposed to me. My hike. My hike. My hike. My hike. It is, it is your hike. hike. Hey, welcome to Blue Collars. That's a beautiful pack. Look. Don't look at my teacup. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, look at your teacup. now so we walk pack. this way. For two and a half miles, we walk this way. Yep. Let's go! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ready, dude? Huh? Ready? Yeah, you filming me? Filming you? Yep. Hey, what's up? Adventuring Buck. Buckeye? Uh -huh, not much, man. Imagine me seeing you here. Hey, that's crazy. It there is crazy. A little stereo vision. Look at this. This is nice. Coming out of the Clifty by halfway back. Man, come on, dude. I've got to carry this shit out. Cans. Why do you do that, man? Let me catch you doing that one time. You'll never do it again. I fucking promise you. Now that's better. Now we fixed it. Thanks to Venture and Buckeye for dealing with my psychotic tendencies to want to smash people's heads against trees. Yeah. I've been here for a while. It's just, man, this is the way it should look, man. On a fire pit full of your garbage. Jiffy Pop. Why did you bring Jiffy Pop back here? Like they actually make popcorn for backpackers. It doesn't have to be Jiffy Pop. And if you bring it back, man, it's just as easy to take it out. It's even lighter. If you carried all that canned food in here, you're worried about carrying your trash weight out? You're doing terrible math. Terrible math. Addicted to adventure does not like that. You're a bad person. Try to be better. I'll say a prayer for you. All right, so, adventuring Buckeye I couldn't stand the thought of me doing the turkey without him, so he decided to bring be rad for his old lady teacup and uh yeah so he decided to bring them on a death march because he was just couldn't bear the thought of me finishing the turkey without him so he's like yeah i think i think everybody'd be fine but in all reality it's a death march that's all it is so we didn't do big miles yesterday but that's what can't freak man that is the hardest trail in the park because you're hiking on top of a cliff, essentially. If you took all the foliage away, you're right on the edge of the cliff. So the trail is only, you know, maybe 10 inches in spots, maybe a little narrower. And if you make one slip, it's your last one, or you're going to wish it was your last one. So today we're going through the cliffy, and uh, 
we're gonna bust this section out. Try to be down on Hanson's Point tonight, so I don't know. We'll see. It's a lot of miles. But uh man, that'll that'll put us in good shape to finish the turkey. May skip the beard. Just because I hate silver run. I had a problem down there one time. So it's a spur turn. You gotta walk down and back. I don't like that either. So may end up skipping this beard. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I call this dude the lawnmower, bro. Well, that's probably uh, YouTubers get these shots. Just like that. So, we're down here in the river bottom. <laughs> made the same mistake we made the first time we were here. Went way, way over there. Well, look, but now, right somebody's okay. put that in. Hey look, they got one right there too. Yep, and there's another one right there. There must have been lots of people who get turned around in here. Well, look, at the, look at the path right there. Well, it's a solid path going over there, yeah. for sure. <laughs> Yep, at least it just wasn't us. <laughs> Low rate's kind of slowed down. I'm going to squeeze. I feel like when I screwed the filter on top of the smart water bottle, it messed up my low rate. I'm not getting a good seal now. Got across this river. Oh. Let's do it. Get it over with. Yep, yep, it's not bad. That's not bad. Oh. All right. I can't feel my toes. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's almost over, dude. Oh, it hurts really bad. Yeah. Right there is when it hurts the worst. What? Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, baby. Oh. Ooh. Oh, that sucked really bad. It's a lot better when you get out. By now, you don't feel any of the sharp rocks anyhow. <laughs> I didn't feel nothing. Almost there, baby. Come on. Woo! Keep going. Do it, do it, do it! I think my husband's hurting. Get through it, honey, please. Honey, please. Honey, please. I'm so glad I got the video. No problem. Woo! That's what's up. Woo! That sucked balls. <laughs> Holy shit. As soon as your feet come out, they start warming. <laughs> Baby, what about the one up there? See the one up there? What? So, come up. Hey. So you can get across that one. Go, go, go across that one. Go across this one. Yeah, that's the best one. one. 
dirty out there. Your feet's going to get wet, so don't be afraid to put your foot near water. You got waterproof feet, yeah. so. No, they're not waterproof no more. No? No. Why not? Because I just got water in my shoes. There you go. Good. That's what's up, my friend. Welcome to the I Cross the Tree Log Club. Holy shit, that's scary. Woo! Yeah, so I've been hiking around, venturing Buckeye, his wife Teacup, and B-Rad back there for a while. And uh, we already did our creek crossing, took our shoes off, went to barefoot. We uh, did a log crossing, that was pretty cool. Now we're heading up to Bison Way Connector. We're going to cut it down. Cut down into the shelter we Pop back up on Hanson's Point. Set up camp. So, it's the plan for the day. Huh. Kind of is experimenting with that GoPro. I don't know if that's going to be worth it or not. But, yeah, when we went through the cold water barefoot, man... It hurt real bad, but it was therapeutic on your feet, kind of. Get to the other side, dry your foot off on your toboggan you sleep in. Put clean, warm, dry socks on. Put shoes back on. Feel like a million bucks. So, that was pretty nice. That was, was a burning a little, little roller coaster there. Hurt my calves in pretty good. But yeah, that's what we're doing. Put, put the trail. Not gonna end up going to Turkey. I always feel like I kind of let myself down when I, I say, oh, I'm gonna start trailhead. I'm gonna do 83 miles. I get through 40 and I'm like, nah, I'm good. I always feel self-conscious about that or bad. But that's my hike. Sometimes I'm able to follow through with the plan perfectly, flawlessly. And uh, other times I get sidetracked I want to do other things. So, sometimes it's cool, sometimes it's not. Something just happened right here. All them leaves all disturbed. I don't know what that was about. What happened? Oh, yeah, something was in here rooting around big time. I don't know what that is. I'll show these guys. See if we figure it out. Love this little green tunnel here. It's a cool little spot. It's a lot more sturdy than the last one. Yeah. Dude, you can see the mushrooms down here. Nice. There you go. Come on. Be rad, showing how it's done. Is that what we do? Step on this log. Stop flipping it. Step on this log. Walk down it. A little technical section here. They took the low path. Be rad and I took the high path. There you go, baby. Good job. See why we camped over there, though? Yeah. Come on, people. You ain't hiker trash. You're just trashy hikers. Come on, man. What is that? Oh, Thanks, Tank. I got it. Thanks, Tank. I just don't understand, like, why why you do that, man. Hey, hey. You're just a trashy person. You're not hiker trash. 
Never will be. Hiker trash catch you out here. Stomp mud hole in your ass. You know why I'm an ultralighter? So I can pick up all the trash you leave behind. He carried a poop rag yesterday. I was so proud of him. Yeah, it's just crappy, man. The good thing is, there's one good hiker for every 10 people that are just trashy people. And I'm one of the low percentage that picks up all of everybody else's slack. So, if we get more people out here like me, we can maintain our trail pretty well from what you do to it. Thanks a lot, trashy people. Yep. That's a staircase. You just start working your way up it. Like pudding rock. Real grippy though, and then you end up way up there. Yeah, hey buddy, you guys ready to do this? No. Oh, it's amazing. Listen. The only thing you have to do going up this is don't fall. That's it. Next it's stop, up there. I them. This ain't no joke. No. You're fine. Keep coming to this. Keep coming to your left. Keep coming to your left. Follow the footsteps. Keep coming to your left. Now you're gonna come straight up. And you're coming to a shelf. Step in it. No, 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 no. Straight up. Straight up. Up, up, up. Straight up. There you go. I need a breath. Look how beautiful that is. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you bashy hikers. If you're going to leave something on the trail, this is what you leave. Trail magic, baby. There's still seeds in that. Now, I'll tell the true story. We actually met some people along the way, and they said they left these up here. So we've been... We've been looking. We've been uh, vying for permit for uh, position to see who's in first, <laughs> you know, up ahead of the trail to uh, find the seeds. And I was it, man. Now we gotta go up there. <laughs> that is some serious elevation. Straight up. There you go. That's it. Yeah. Right there. Ledge time. It's amazing. I almost died hey. here last week. He's trying to stab but me again. If I'd have died here last week, you'd have had a tombstone that looked like that up here for me. Or a cross. We'd have to come back up no. here and... Chisel it. You'd have to come up here and chisel it, Brad. Yeah. You're part of the hey, blue collar. I'd do, I'd do it for you. Hell yeah. There'd be a 242 up here. 242, son. Yeah, you know that. Better believe it. JV. Yep. Mama's gone. She's like, she screw dumb. you guys. I am out here. <laughs> oh, sweet topsoil. How I love you so. <laughs> she is gone. Trailblazer. Teacup is trailblazing. Did you just shake her head at me? I think so. I'm, I'm supposed to stop talking now. Stop talking. Let's do this, Brad. Let's go up. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, dude, was that staircase we started? He's over there now. Huh? Guy, that one shirt. Yeah. Oh, my God. Right here. Right here. Yeah! I'm an all-American hero. You know what I'm doing? This. <coughs> Shannon. What? Tell me how you feel right now. Oh, Chris. You fat? Oh. Do you feel empowered, though? Oh, my God. I was going to die. Here, back here, baby. I'm glad I'm not dead. You didn't I'm die? Not. I'm a badass. I'm a badass. I'm a badass. I'm a badass. Woo! Yeah. And all you are is an asshole for dragging your wife up on some kind of death march up a cliff. What's wrong with you, dude? I think, I think he's got a life insurance policy. And I 
want you to know that it was murder. <laughs> now, hold on. Hold on. Let's talk about what's really happening here. Did you just buy a bunch of hiking gear to become a hiker? Is this what you thought it was going to be? All the fame, fortune, and glory? No close-ups. No. Oh. Just think. We come up that way last time. That's a, that's a, it's like a series of boulders. It's actually harder than this, honestly. You can go down it, though. It's come pretty easy going down it. it. Yeah. Yeah, this is that bag I was using to blow mine up with. That's it. It's probably a rubbed it on the black forest. I took a little pump. Yeah. That's how it's done, son. Yeah. What's for dinner tonight? Let's see. Oh, my favorite chicken fried rice. Yeah, baby. It's raining. It's a lot colder than we expected. A lot rainier than we expected. So I'm doing a uh, evac. I'm gonna hike down the cliffs. Try to hitchhike up the road. If I don't get a hitch, then I'll move on to Wildcat Trail, Swift Camp Creek. Go down and get the car. So this is a speed trial. Climb down that. It's not too bad. It's a little weird when it's a river. Here I am walking out of Bison Way Trail again. Only this time the car's not up at Osborne. The car's down at Rock Bridge. So I either road hike it the whole way or shoot down Wildcat, Swift Camp. Most of it's downhill, but it's pretty treacherous. And I don't know what it'd be like doing it in the rain. My other option is to get a hitch and have them drop me off at Rock Bridge Road or down at the car, one of the, one of the other, so. We have options. See what happens. So, here's an update. I made it up to, more trash. Made it up to Osborne Bend and uh, this young couple, caught the guy's name, his name is Reed. I don't know what the girl's name was. Super, super cool people, man. They give me a ride down here to Rock Bridge. That just cut like six hours of hiking, hard hiking out of the way, and possibly a, a treacherous trail hike down uh, Swift Camp. Sorry, I'm out of breath, I've been running. So, I got a short hike down to the car, grab the car, go up, grab the others. We're good to go, man. This trip is in the books. This is what happens when hiking goes wrong. Man, it's raining and it's like 30 some degrees. It's pretty cold, pretty miserable. So, once again, Red River got the best of me. It happens. It's truly no joke, man. Especially the route we have planned out. I am gonna do the turkey eventually. Just not today. So. I don't care who you are. Hiking in the cold rain, it ain't fun. But, so, there's some of the road down there. So that means we're about to get into a switchback. Yeah, buddy. That's a sign you want to see. I'm sure this camera's bouncing all over. I have it hooked in my fanny pack. And uh, I know there's a, I can see it bouncing a lot. Oh man, that's a split right there. Parking lot right around the corner, man. Yeah, 
Yes, there's the car. Yeah, buddy. That was a rough trip. I got from uh, Reed and his, uh, I would assume his girlfriend. Man, that was super cool. You never know what you're gonna get with a hitch. I've had a couple people pass me. Uh, one guy even turned around to come back past me. <laughs> I don't know what that was about, but sometimes, man, you get lucky and you get somebody like Reed. That dude was super cool, man. Uh, I wish the best for you. You got a lot of good karma coming your way. I believe in karma, man. That's why I picked trash up the whole time. I'm on the trail. Just get good karma from Mother Nature, and she always makes sure I'm right some way or another. So I believe in that. So hopefully you get a little good karma after uh, your good deed you did for me today, man. That really helped me out. Cut about six hours out of the day. So it means a lot to me, man. Uh, and I know it does the rest of my crew also. So thank you very much. All right. Look at it. Look what I found. <laughs> you guys need a ride? Yeah. Okay. All right, man. Right on. We hey. made it. <laughs> Rescue op number three in the books. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll actually finish the turkey. <laughs> yep. Rescue attempt number three completed. Turkey attempt number three, goose egg. What up? So, Shannon, for your first hike, uh, how would you rate this hike on a scale of one to four? One being what? One being... I'll never do it again in my life and four being the greatest experience you've ever had. Let's be honest now. I would do it again. You would do it again? Okay. Nicer weather? Yes, nicer weather. Uh, right. Same trail? Um, Was it what you expected? I got it like, it coming from both angles here. I feel like I'm getting bombarded. You are. Yeah. Um, the Indian staircase. I would never do again. Yeah. Lock up your children. I kind of figured that. Out. <laughs> Me too. I've got video. I think my husband has a life insurance policy, and mm -hmm. I would like to know more about that. <laughs> <laughs> it should be no good. No good? I'm checking with Nationwide. You didn't die, though. You made it just fine. I should have died. You did a great job. Maybe you did die a couple times. Who knows? I did. Sometimes that happens. You gotta buy. You gotta be dead to be reborn. You live. Yeah. 